In the beginning, in prehistoric vastness, humanity emerged, scattered into tribes and clans, each isolated in its own silent world. In this primitive era, man, a mute witness to nature and its mysteries, was hindered by his inability to communicate. Humanity's first steps into the universe of communication were tentative, marked by elementary gestures and sounds, cries and signs that formed the prelude to a language still to be born. These rudimentary expressions, forged by the necessities of survival and social cohesion, were the early drafts of a dialogue with the world. In this quest for understanding and expression, every gesture, every look, every sound became a symbol, an attempt to break the wall of silence. It was a time when humanity was learning to articulate its thoughts, to transform the intangible into the tangible. These early forms of expression, though rudimentary, laid the foundations for a linguistic evolution that would shape the destiny of man. Over time, these primitive symbols and sounds transformed into a more structured language, a complex fabric of words and phrases that allowed for richer and more nuanced communication. Language, in its evolution, became the mirror of human diversity, reflecting the cultural richness of different societies. Each people wove its own linguistic tapestry, coloring its words with local nuances, traditions, and myths. Parallel to the evolution of spoken language, another revolution was beginning, that of writing. The Amazigs, people of the land and sky, began to engrave their stories and knowledge on stone and other materials. These first forms of artistic expression, mixing drawings and inscriptions, were the precursors of a writing system that would flourish in Tifinagh. These inscriptions, though simple, carried the essence of communication and collective memory, a precious legacy for future generations. The adoption of writing marked a decisive turning point in human history. It was the beginning of an era where thoughts and knowledge could be recorded and transmitted beyond the boundaries of time and space. Writing became a window into the past, a bridge to the future, and a powerful tool for preserving cultural identity. Before we dive into the details of Tifinagh, let's have a little fun together. Here's a keyboard with Tifinagh letters and their corresponding Latin letters. I challenge you to guess the word I've just written in Tifinagh. Once you've cracked it, you'll know exactly what comes next. And I'll be eagerly waiting for your responses. In the comments, feel free to write what you want in the Tifinagh script. You can find the link to the digital keyboard in the video description. The advent of writing, this sublime art of engraving thought, marked a new era in the history of humanity. The Amazigs, an ancient and wise people, joined this evolution with the adoption of the Libico-Berber script. These early inscriptions, carefully engraved on stone or other materials, were the ancestors of the Tifinagh script. Each engraving was a fragment of their soul, an indelible trace of their existence. These early writings, silent witnesses of ancient times, were scattered across the vast Sahara, from southern Morocco to Algeria, Tunisia, Libya, and even the Canary Islands. The exact origin of the Tifinagh script remains shrouded in mystery. Some researchers see a kinship with the Phoenician alphabet, while others suggest an independent genesis marked by slight Phoenician influences. These writings, diverse in form, shared a common characteristic. The absence of vowels, typical of abjads, in which only consonants are noted. Over the centuries, the Tifinagh script evolved, transforming to reflect the cultural and linguistic changes of its users. The Toregs in particular perpetuated this writing tradition, using it to record not only the language, but also personal messages, love notes, and in decoration. The geometric and distinct nature of the Tifinagh letters, which could be written from left to right, right to left, horizontally or vertically, testified to the flexibility and richness of this writing system. The Tifinagh script, in addition to its practical function, became a powerful symbol of Amazigh identity. In a constantly evolving world where cultures met and influenced each other, the Tifinagh script remained an anchor, an unbreakable link with the past, while adapting to the realities of the present. It symbolized the resilience and pride of a people, a script not only surviving but thriving, 
evolving through the ages. The Tefina script, like a flame in the desert, spread across Northwest Africa, becoming an emblematic symbol of the Amazigh heritage. This ancient script, passed down from generation to generation, found its place not only in historical and cultural records, but also in the daily life of the Tuareg people. Tuareg women, in particular, played a key role in transmitting this script, using it for personal notes, love letters, and ornaments. The public use of Tifina experienced periods of restriction, notably in Libya under Gaddafi's regime, but its resilience allowed its survival and reintroduction. In Morocco, the turn of the 21st century saw the official recognition of Tifina for writing Tamazik, marking a historic moment for the revitalization of Amazigh writing. This official recognition paved the way for a broader integration of Tifina in modern society, strengthening its role in preserving the Amazigh language and culture. Tifina, a witness to the history and identity of the Amazigh's, faced numerous challenges over the centuries. Its history is marked by a struggle against marginalization and cultural erasure. Despite these challenges, the Amazigh's resisted and preserved their alphabet, a powerful symbol of their identity and heritage. This perseverance testifies to the deep connection between writing and cultural identity and the will of a people to keep their ancestral traditions alive. With the advent of the 21st century, the Tifinagh script experienced a significant renaissance, particularly in Morocco, where it was officially adopted for writing Tamazight in 2003. This decision marked an important step in the recognition and valorization of Amazigh culture. Tifinagh is now visible in education, media, and even in public signage, symbolizing a cultural renaissance for the Amazigh people. This integration of Tifinagh into public and educational spheres reflects a growing awareness of the importance of preserving and promoting cultural and linguistic diversity. It represents a victory for the Amazigh's in their struggle for recognition of their identity and cultural heritage. The Amazigh language and writing have played a crucial role in transmitting culture and history. Through the Tifinagh script, a rich heritage of literature, poetry, and knowledge has been preserved. The motifs found in the Tifinagh script have influenced other cultural aspects, such as art and weaving, demonstrating the deep interconnection between writing and Amazigh culture. This cultural richness is not only a treasure for the Amazigh's, but also for the entire world, offering a unique glimpse into an ancient civilization and its intellectual and artistic contributions. In Morocco, the official recognition of the Amazigh language and culture in 2011 was a decisive moment for the country. This step encouraged a cultural renaissance with the emergence of new literary genres and scientific contributions in the Amazigh language. The adoption of the Tifina script as a symbol of identity and pride strengthened the Amazigh culture's position in the contemporary world. Institutions like IRCAM, the Royal Institute of Amazigh Culture, play a vital role in promoting and preserving the Amazigh language and script. These efforts ensure that the Amazigh heritage is not only preserved, but also celebrated and integrated into education and public life, thus ensuring its transmission to future generations.